uh, I know it's halfway eaten, but this is me trying out uh, brown sugar cinnamon flavored cinnamon. Ten out of ten. All right, now we're trying out cookies and cream. I know I took a little bite, but y'all are gonna see me eat this shit right now. Okay, then. So here's me trying it out. really good i recommend it to anyone if you love pastries i recommend it i love it honestly the top one is red velvet but i'm sorry i couldn't get it on this one but i promise i'll get it on the next one i love this one though i recommend it 10 out of 10 oh my god so relaxing all right so today we're hitting um leg day quad focus and i'm doing smith machine i'm not doing the barbell because right now i'm just trying to stay off of barbell because of how I'll, how high my ego is but we're gonna do um High volume um, leg extensions and till failure with um, hack squats, and then we'll do till failure perhaps with um, Smith machine squats with like good form and stuff. And then I'll probably like add in some calves and probably like another leg workout. I'll, I'll try to see down the road, but right now I'm trying to fix it up the videos because I'd be like concentrating and I want to have more talking segments, more like fucking around segments. Right now you just got you guys saw um, my taste review segment which the pop tarts and i'm not gonna lie they're pretty good but you know the red velvet is better but all right right now we're gonna hit this you guys are gonna see me i'm gonna warm up go up do my top set and then do my lower set and then go heavy as always I hit that shit, man, it's so heavy. Like I told you I'm doing heavy sets, but that was so heavy, man. <sighs> I'm out of breath, so I think I'm at a 10. <laughs> I don't even have my belt too, <laughs> but I'm gonna do that. Try to get 15, or no, I will get 15. And after that, I'll probably drop into 35 and go to failure. And, whew, whew, I'm gonna be dead. I mean, long dead. I was like doing the first rep. I saw how my my butt shifted, and I was like, nah, ain't no way I'm getting 15. But eventually, I did get it. Like I just had to do like what the powerlifters do, with like, and they go down, 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 and then let it all out when it's when they're on the top. That's what I recommend if you try doing uh, squats or benches or deadlifts. When you're all the way down, and uh, you're all the way down, you keep the air. You let out as soon as you start like feeling like compression coming out, like it's too heavy for you. You be like, Whoa. that's what I recommend. That's what I do. And damn, bro, I have like a juicy pump, but my pants are baggy for a reason. I do not have any legs whatsoever. Fuck, <laughs> it's just so sad because like imagine having a dream but upper body and you just have like stick bigger legs. <laughs> right, that's why I'm hitting legs, but that's why I keep baggy pants. Either way, you know, pants exist. If you don't hit legs, pants exist. That's what I recommend. Baggy, baggy pants. If you don't have any legs. <laughs> and yet, I must try. <laughs> it's not about winning or losing. It's about me taking you on right here and right now. with 35 right now i'm gonna do 25 with 15 reps i was supposed to go to a failure but okay 
I have this huge craving to hit deadlifts, and it, it's, it's, it sounds weird, like saying craving, but I want to hit deadlifts so bad. So I'm gonna hit sumo, neutral grip, that deadlifts, and it's weird, you know, like it's like you, it's like you craving Jack in the Box. That's how it is for me craving deadlifts. That's how bad I want to hit deadlifts, and I'm gonna go hit deadlifts right now after this set. I'm not, I'm not gonna record this set since I'm not gonna do like a tip failure set. I'm just gonna hit 15 efficient reps. RPE like what seven? RPE six. RPE means like how how hard you're going. So like if I'm doing deadlifts 365 with my max strength, that's RPE 10. And, and, and that's like a short example of what RPE is. But I'm gonna get this shit right now. Right now I'm gonna hit 135 neutral grip sumo deadlifts. And honestly, I always always warmed up with 135 because my ego is too high. I don't know if you've seen the videos like, oh, if you don't start up with 135, like, you're a bitch, basically. Like, yeah, that's that's the reason why I start with 135. But don't be like me, who has a high-ass ego. <laughs> be, if you if you could only rep out 225, start off with 25. Start off with the bar. That's what that's what I recommend, you know. For me, I got lucky, and I was able, I'm, I was capable of doing 315 within three months, you know. Others don't get that. That's others' um, personal record from two years of working out. But I recommend, like, starting off little and progressing like over and over but yeah right now I'm gonna do 135 because I don't want to be a bitch and I'm gonna do 15 reps because I'm gonna be doing reps instead of, or I might do progressing over I don't know I'm gonna see how the bar feels but you guys are gonna see me do it right now okay as you guys can see that moved way too fast for me so right now I'm gonna bump up 225 Get a feel of it and probably do reps to be honest. Holy, the lighting is so guacamole. Holy. <laughs> okay, let me go over here. Yeah, but right now I'm gonna do uh, 225. I'm like literally crouching down. I look so sus. But I'm gonna do uh, 225 and see where that goes. <sighs> oh, and I forgot to say um, if you're gonna do sumo deadlifts, I recommend doing it on your hamstring day, <laughs> not your quad day, but it focuses on both your hamstrings and quads. But I don't recommend it on your quads, do it on your hammy days. But right now I'm, gonna do, I'm doing it on my quads because I want deadlifts, that's why. But right now we're gonna put up 225 and see where that goes. <laughs> I'm so happy right now because I literally came back from like the other day and I wasn't even capable of doing 315, 335, or 355 from conventional. Uh, two days ago, I was like sad because I wasn't able to do that two days ago, but now let's see what I'm gonna do. Woo! Let's get this shit. Leave my sight. You know why. Our teacher is an extraordinary man. The time he spends training you is all for nothing. Why are you even here? Can never find this love anywhere else. The way you cry like a baby all day long. Aren't you ashamed of yourself? I hate even looking at you, so get out! Ooh, I'm gonna sit there. I don't even know how much I got, but it's it's narrow, like narrow grip or neutral grip, neutral grip. So you guys can't tell me shit on why it's so horrible because I'm like focusing on that for my forearms and also because it helps you like with better strength. So that's that. I did like what five? I'm gonna drop down to 255, 225. I did 245. I wasn't supposed to do that. But I did it, and I don't have a belt right now. I forgot that shit. I thought I was only hitting fucking Smith Machine squats. And I still gotta hit my leg extensions. <laughs> but all right, <laughs> I'm gonna load up to 25 right now. I'm gonna hit that shit, I'm gonna go crazy. I'm about to be like David later real quick. The fact is, I hate myself more than anyone else. Okay, so now I'm gonna hit leg extensions. Jeremy's famous leg extensions. Right now I just did two sets. I, earlier I just did two sets of deadlifts of sumo. But right now I'm gonna do my fucking insane fucking leg extensions. Like, you know, the famous from Jeremy Lance, of course. But, um, 
and I'm gonna warm up two sets of warming up on leg, leg extensions and after that I'm gonna do my crazy sets witness this right now you guys are gonna witness my, 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 my downfall right now Okay, so that's warm-up number one, 45 for 10, and then 10 seconds of rest scene on top. And then now it's gonna be my second warm-up, 65 times 10, 10 seconds rest, and then after that, I'm gonna do my tail failure set, and then my crazy tail failure set. You guys are gonna see it. You guys are gonna witness my downfall. Okay, now I'm gonna do my failure, Drop set 165 to 15. I, I might, I might, I might scream a lot. I might cry to be honest, cause I hate this shit. This is the worst part of leg day, like doing this shit. And I don't have my buddy to help me out, so it's even worse. But you guys are gonna witness hell, like literally hell. Like this is like, okay, like pretend you go to hell, and like this is like the one sin you do. This is the shit that you gotta repeat on loop. This shit fucking hurts, and it hurts, bro. It hurts your soul. Like you fall to your knees, no homo, but like you do that. You guys are gonna witness my downfall right now. Just to failure. I literally can't walk. I literally can't walk. Uh, I just died to be honest. Holy. Give me a second. I'm dead. I'm fucking dead. Okay, you guys just saw my downfall. And I, I honestly, like, it took me like six to like seven minutes to recover. But now I'm gonna do 85 to failure, then drops it to 45, which I'm not gonna do like, oh, 85, 65. Now I'm gonna do 85, then 45 to failure. 
I'm experimenting right now, but you guys are gonna witness my downfall, man. And I, I, I honestly don't want. I don't. I don't want to live. I hate leg day. <laughs> that's why I'm. Uh, that's why I'm wearing pads to be honest, to not show off my legs. <laughs> but all right, you guys are gonna witness this. Yes, I can. Can I do body squats? <laughs> no, I cannot. Oh, so I couldn't do body squats, but I, I could walk little by little. But I just did 85, then drops it to a 45 to a failure. <laughs> now I'm gonna try this. Ooh, holy, I'm gonna try this workout. Um, lunges, but as said, I'm like, like behind behind the wall or like standing on the wall. I guess you could say laying on the wall, and I'm just going like to failure probably. But. <laughs> I don't recommend. Like, if you guys think I'm being over dramatic, no, I'm not being over dramatic. Like, once would you like dead ass hit, hit this shit? You don't want to live. You, you dead ass don't. You, if you feel like extensions and you hit it as hard as hard as I did, you don't want to deal with this. Oh my god, I want that. <laughs> oh, oh. Fuck. Okay, so I'm gonna try the workout, and it's my first time ever doing it. So do not judge my form. I don't hit lunges, and in general, I don't hit like standing on behind a wall type lunges. I honestly don't really hit legs that good, but you guys are gonna witness my downfall again. Again. By the way, I know you guys are gonna be laughing at my downfall. I know, I hope you guys are laughing. Oh, well, I don't hope it, but I mean, if you guys are, I understand. <laughs> uh, but let's get to it. <laughs> don't worry about it, Zeddy. That's good enough progress. Mastering even one is cause for celebration. The grabs, thunder breathing has six forms. All I can manage to do is one. It's alright to cry. Just don't ever give up. You can only do one thing. Perfect it. Holy, that kills, man. That really kills. But that's my first set. I got three more. Uh, I do not know who ever invented this. I hope. I don't know. I'm just putting on your downfall, to be honest. I, I'm dying. I'm literally dying inside. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna drop the weight because I'm fucking up my form a lot. Uh, I'm like not very balanced, but you know, you guys are gonna witness me be balanced. Ooh, my legs are killing. I'm gonna hit this right now. Only words I gotta say is push past your limits, and after that, push past those limits, and after that, you don't have any limits. If that makes sense, basically what I'm saying is, if you pass your limits that you put on yourself, let's say 30 times 10, and then you couldn't get, you, you, you possibly can't get 10, push past that, dude. Hit 11, and then push past that limit. Hit 12, 13, 14, you know, keep on breaking the, the, the glass. Keep on being better. You guys gonna me? You guys are gonna witness me doing that. Really, you guys really are. But fuck, I'm sore as hell.
It's still fairly my boys and girls. Holy shit. I, I hit my head right there. And then I started to see stars. I, then I thought I was about to faint. I was like, yeah, I'm going out. <laughs> Fuck, I'm fucking dead. All right, we got one more set. And I think this is going to be walking lunges, hopefully. Whew. Time to break past my limits, I guess you could say. Such a breathing first floor. The potential lies within you. Don't ever give up. Okay, so some guys, oh no, some people will say that my form is wrong and the reason why my form is wrong is because I'm super tired to be honest and I can't do this shit right now. But I promise, next day I'm gonna go heavy and I promise I will do it. But as I said, like that type of, men the type of mentality you gotta have is the one that's like, you push past your limits, you push it again. You keep on pushing, you keep on pushing. At that, I was halfway in my halfway point where I was literally on the, right here. I was literally right there. And I was literally, I was literally dying. I was gonna fail, I was gonna quit right then and there. I was gonna say, fuck it, you know, I could, I could probably do more next time. But no, I kept on pushing, I kept on pushing. Even if my form was wrong, it doesn't mean shit. You just gotta always push past your limits. Like, as I always say, push past your limits. And when you push past those limits, you push it again. You keep on going until your body gives up on you. Your body, Scientifically, it, it, it's stronger, it's way stronger than you think. It's your mind telling you that you can do it. But, I mean, as I said, I went to the point where my body failed because of exhaustion. But, I mean, <laughs> that was a crazy leg day. I might have to skip cows, but let's see if I must skip it or hit it. <laughs> let's see, it's like a hit or miss. <laughs> Thank you guys for, for seeing me fail.